What's good with the YouTube? It is your boy Vaughn, and as you guys can see by the title, we are back with a new banger SML video for you guys today. This one is called SML Movie Junior's Loyalty Test. Now, I'm assuming that this might be on his girl Penelope, but we will see for sure in the episode. This literally just dropped, and I'm ready to dive into it, baby. Original video will always be in the description down below. Why you guys are down there? If you like to follow me on my TikTok, that is where I am doing my Call of Duty gameplay videos and future streams as well. Make sure you guys are subscribed to the channel with notifications turned on. That way, you do not miss any of the uploads. And without further ado, baby, we're going to go ahead and we're going to dive right into this banger. Let's get it. Today is the last day of school. Before last day of school break. before Christmas so break. Okay. We're going to have a free day today. They spelled break wrong for sure, but yeah. We got a free day? No work? Oh, hell yeah, dude. Uh, you spelled break wrong. No, I didn't. That's how you spell break. It's spelled B R E A K. That's how you spell break if you broke something. This is how you spell break if something is stopping. Like. They have the wrong teacher in the classroom. I'm going to just leave it at that. How a car uses its brakes <laughs> to stop. Like, this is a Christmas <laughs> break because we are stopping school for your Christmas vacation. <laughs> I guess he used it in I'm a different way. I'm not teacher, Cody, not you. The teacher is always right. But you're wrong. All right, Christ, that's it. Since Cody <laughs> wanted to be a smart ass, you're going to have homework over Christmas break. I'm going to go prepare. That's so. That's so. Good going for us. Yeah, yeah. Sorry, guys. Whenever someone makes a spelling mistake, I have to just keep pushing and pushing. Nah, Cody, what about it? when you make a mistake? You go into the closet with Timmy. Ain't nobody judge you for that. So shut the hell up next time instead What's of getting everybody else home. Hey, Cody, you freaking frick. I want to frick your mom. <laughs> so, hey. Penelope, what do you want to do during Christmas okay. break? Other than a shit ton of homework. Sorry. Well, Junior, I was really hoping we could spend time together on Christmas Day. Oh, well, do you on like Christmas want a Day. Christmas gift or something? Because I haven't got you anything. Yeah, I want a Christmas present. I got you something. Junior, Christmas is in less than a week. <laughs> well, the stores are still Bless open. Me, so I'm going get you a gift today. What do you want? I really want something, but it's Really expensive. What is it? <laughs> a Harry Poopon necklace. Harry Poopon. What the fuck? You think my nigga rich? I don't even know what that is. Harry Poopon necklace. Junior, Harry Poopon is the most name brand show off expensive necklace there is. All the white girls want one. Yep. Well, how expensive <laughs> is it? All the white well, girls. Funky rap terms. Shit, about a band or two. Sounds about right. Lil Wayne did say I'm richer than a bitch without the Harry Poopon. <laughs> yeah, he did say that. Lil Wayne does love Harry Poopon necklaces. <laughs> one to $2,000 for a necklace? You don't have to get it for me, but I okay okay y'all i literally just had this conversation with some of my friends about how these little kids today are talking about items of this price when i was growing up as a kid like we was begging for 20 dollars shoes at payless bro like really this is crazy and, and think about this junior if you got me something like that i could like never break up with you because what other boyfriend could get me something like that Oh, mm. so Penelope's I mean, a materialistic you know, I girl. I for you. All she cares I mean, about is me. what Junior can uh, get for her so and not do homework. for her. Thanks, Cody. Mm. Sorry. I threw my shit away, dude. I'm not doing homework on Christmas. Loyalty oh, test, Christmas indeed. Break. You're needed. right. I'm gonna look at these hairy poopon necklaces. <sighs> Junior, you're not actually gonna buy one of those, are you? I'm I don't like the name of the necklace. Like, it just sounds like... <laughs> and they got... The I just realized, bro, they got the shit emoji or whatever you want to call it right there. Too. <laughs> hairy the poopon. Like, look, this one's only $930. <laughs> Dude, you can't see that pebble. It's so small. She's not gonna like that. Well, how about I get her the $2,500 one? How are you gonna even afford that? I was thinking I could steal my dad's credit card and buy the necklace, and hopefully he doesn't see the charge until after I give her the necklace. But, but by that time, she'll be <laughs> Property. Junior, you're not going to own her just because you bought her a necklace. She said if I buy her this necklace, she'll never leave me. Dude, she's not an indentured servant. Yeah, she can say anything. It doesn't mean it's true. She could still leave you. Well, I'll tell her, look, I'll only give you this necklace if you sign this contract saying I own you. Okay, well, even if she agreed to do <laughs> that... Junior always thinking legal, outside the box, ain't he? Well, what stupid idiot would make that rule? Abraham Lincoln. Why'd he do that? <clears throat> Oh, yeah, you know, nigga. I, yeah, I guess we just guess it now. Look. <laughs> hey, yeah, I ain't gonna lie. That I see how Joseph could have took that a little offensively. Talk about, uh, I guess, like, hey, let's just go back to the Harry Poupon. I so grew up with I white boys as friends, too, guys. It would be stupid because she could just leave me anyway. <laughs> yes. Okay, so then I should test her loyalty before I spend so much money on a Christmas gift. What, how are you going to do that? I'll hire a really hot guy to ask Penelope for a number, and if she gives her number, she's a cheating bitch, and I won't give her the necklace. Damn. Ooh, I like this plan, dude. I don't know. This doesn't seem Good crazy. idea, but the way not Junior fair. approached, she number, approached she's it. She's a cheater. If she says, I have a boyfriend, <laughs> then she's loyal. What's not fair about it? Well, what if she gives him a fake number? That's still cheating because it's, uh, you're entertaining it. Yeah, of yeah. course. If she gives the guy a <laughs> fake number, the guy might think she made a mistake and said, Hmm, is it because she's entertaining it? Yeah, yeah. I, I would say yeah. I would say yeah. If she even gives him a fake number, then yeah, she she probably 
Yeah, that's L. That's like, L. Oh, she got a number wrong. She really was into me. She saw my, my wiener imprint in my pants and she liked it. Yeah. That doesn't seem like cheating to me. If a girl asked me for my number, I would say, I have a girlfriend. I'm loyal. Go away. Because that's my boy. He loyal. <laughs> mm -hmm. Junior, of course you would, Junior. Well, of course you would, Junior. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, if a girl asks for our number, we're going to say yes, especially if it's a 10 out of 10 Coke bottle shaped ass, busting out the frames type bitch. Well, that's why it doesn't <laughs> seem fair to Penelope, because you're getting a 10 out of 10 guy to ask her. Well, girls should stay loyal, Cody. So, so I think I should do this. I'm going to hire a really Technically, guy there's only uh, one 10 out of 10 guy that I see right here. No homo. And I think it's, uh, what's his name? The Barbie dog, Ken? Her number away. Get, okay, send well, him Penelope's way. Oh, I bet dude, you she gets it. perfect guy. My homeboy Stanley, man, he pulls all the hoes. He has seven on his roster right now. <laughs> Stanley, oh, how we? Fucks. Keeps his dick wet. I'm telling you, smooth as butter. Real <laughs> player made ass nigga. Look, we went to a party one time, and I had this girl. She was 11 out of 10, bro. She was really feeling me. Hot as hell. But then I walked away to get a drink. Next thing you know, she's upstairs with Stanley getting it on. You can't leave him alone with a girl for longer than 30 seconds, bro. Yeah, he picks pockets <laughs> pussy. That's slide of hand, bro. Oh, juggernaut. Slide of hand, bro. He oh, juggernaut, he going crazy. Wait, why have I never heard of this guy because he likes vagina cody not penis look i'm gonna go and get it real quick uh junior aren't you a little worried about stanley he seems a little overqualified for this job he might actually steal your girlfriend well, that's <laughs> what i want i want a guy so hot that she would cheat so i know not to buy her this necklace but i don't think it's just gonna be a job for him here's my man stanley <laughs> he is dead oh you mean stanley oh my hey, stanley we what the hell there. is this i'm thinking he about to pull up a brother or some shit what the hell? You and your Bro. Penis. What's up, guys? Where are the women at? That's my boy. Man, <laughs> is, that, is that Jeffy's voiceover? That's him. Oh, yes. He is him. Himothy. Mr. Metal Detective Dick looking for the hole. <laughs> he don't look like Himothy so at all, my boy. Like your shirt. Thank you. It stands for equality, which means any girl can get it. I like fat Asians, lardy Latinas, obese white women, and big booty black bitches. All of the above, my boy. <laughs> Well, I have a job for you, Stanley. And it includes women, so don't be nervous. Okay, what is it? So I have this girlfriend, and I want to see if she would cheat on me. So I want you to go up to her and ask for her number. And if she gives you her number, then I know to break up with her. Okay, can I pap? I mean, you can do whatever you want. I just want to see if she'll cheat on me. Oh, I guarantee she'll cheat. Yeah, my boy guarantees <laughs> it. It's in the fine print. Yeah, so where is she? <laughs> okay, so here's the plan. I was going to call Guarantees it in the fine print. It's crazy. You. And then I was going to go use the bathroom. And then while you're alone with her on the couch, that's when you ask for her number. Okay. All right, so Cody, Joseph, you hide behind the couch. Okay, I got you, bro. I'm gonna call Penelope. So Penelope, me. I mean, honestly, I, 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 like Junior. You would think that Junior shouldn't be scared. We're gonna see how this goes down right now, guys. But like, Junior hasn't seemed like he has shown any signs of caution or being scared of Penelope giving in to Stanley because of how he looks. But let's find out if uh Stanley is really him like Friend they've been Stanley. saying. So hi. Oh, man, my stomach hurts. I got to go use the bathroom. I'm going to leave you two alone. You would never cheat on me, right? No, Junior. I'll be right back. So how's Junior going? messed it up. Just hanging out. He messed right, it up. I have a shirt on. Wait, do you have a mustache? Yeah, I'm not wearing any underwear. How old are you? 15. You should totally lift up my shirt. How do you know Junior? Today. What? That doesn't answer my question. You're really pretty. Can I get your number? No, I'm not comfortable with that. <laughs> She must have put up some sort of dumb bitch force field that prevents me from getting your number. I can <laughs> hear you. Time to go to plan B. Do you like oranges? Yeah. My balls are the size of oranges. You should totally squeeze them. Okay, you need to leave. Well, I got <laughs> seven other women that would totally be happy to squeeze them. And five of their hands are on my shirt right now. Great. Well, go call them. Go. You know what? I think I might. Oh, weirdo. <laughs> so okay, I think Stanley. Stanley might be him in the wrong kind of way. I hope he's not what I'm thinking he is. Because if he is that... Then fuck Stanley. Ask for your number, what'd you say? <laughs> I told him no, but Junior, how did you know he was going to ask for my number? Uh, I didn't. Guys, you can come out now. Why are your friends hiding behind the couch? <laughs> we were playing hide and seek. I just gave up. So, Cody, when Stanley asked Penelope for her number, what'd she say? Well, she said no. Did she say she had a boyfriend? Not exactly. Did she say she had a boyfriend? No. We have to break up. Junior, he's your <laughs> friend. He should know I'm your girlfriend. If a guy asks for your number, you're supposed to say, no, I have a boyfriend. Go away. You invited me over, and before you walked away you asked if i would ever cheat on you right in front of him and i said no hmm okay go to your house <laughs> true let me think about it. you messed it up junior God, hey, junior got penelope in check though he said go to your house and i'm gonna yeah, think about it <laughs> she seemed weird yeah it might have been a ph balance or something 
You said Stanley pulled hose. I mean, he usually does. He has like a 99% return rate on him. Guys, I think maybe there's just something wrong about Stanley. I mean, it seems like maybe he only likes fat girls. Huh? <laughs> well, really oh, fat shit. Girls, like oh, shit. Cody got a point. And this is exactly what I was thinking. Like, that's the only way a guy as weird as him could get that many girls. I ain't gonna let you talk bad about my homeboy like that. Yeah, obviously <laughs> Stanley gets hot girls because <laughs> Joseph said he stole his 11 out of 10 hot girl. Yeah, I mean, I did say she was bad. And I meant, like, 11 out of 10 on the fat scale. That bitch was huge. A brick house. Oh. I'm talking about bad cholesterol, goddamn. Look, any day she could eat a Debbie cake and be in the grave. I'm talking about heavy breathing, all that shit. Woo! Yeah. She's talking about that. I don't think Stanley was a good baby. enough to, to see if she would cheat. We need to get a rich guy, because girls will cheat for money. So we have to get a rich guy to come up and offer her money to cheat. Like a prostitute? No, 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 no. Like, we need a guy to come up to her and say... You're yeah, what kind of guy What kind of guy do you think girls would cheat with the most? It has to be a nigga that has money, right? The type of girl that you can just pay that ticket, right? And then, boom, give her $1,000 to see if she cheats. It doesn't seem fair to use You gotta find a good one, she's gonna though. leave me over money, then I don't want to be with her at all. Junior, it really seems like you want her to cheat on you. Yes, I want her to cheat because I can't afford that necklace. So let me go call Richard, you know, our rich friend. What do you poor kids want? Yeah, oh, well, my Richard, guys, money, this is right? so wrong. Yeah, my name's Richard, not Richard. <laughs> I'm rich. Okay, so I have this girlfriend, and I want to see if she would cheat on me if you gave her money. Well, of course she'll cheat on you if I give her money. She's a woman. She loves money. Okay, so here's what I think you should do. I think you should go up to her and say, hey, baby, I'll give you $1,000 if you make out with me right now. Or I could do this. I have an even better idea. Cody, pick a number between 1 and 10,000. Well, I got to go with my favorite number, 5. Okay. All right, check your phone. Okay. Okay. Well, you just Apple paid me five dollars. Oh, oh shit! I, I mean, I mean, my favorite number is five thousand. That's what I meant. Too late. Oh, God damn it! I didn't know money was involved. Fuck. Well, yeah, go up to her and do that. <laughs> well, I'm not gonna just give her free money. If you want me to do it, you can give me the money and I'll do it. I don't have any money though. All right, well then, no deal. Oh, okay, I got an idea. There's this really expensive necklace that she wants, so I can go steal my dad's credit card, buy the necklace, give it to you, and you can give her the necklace to see if she would cheat on me. Okay. Okay, let me go get my dad's credit card. Money. That's okay, the dumbest that. idea. Okay, just Wait, what? Poop on store. This necklace was like three thousand dollars my dad's gonna beat me up when he sees <laughs> junior just 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 messed it all up that's the second time he did that in this episode this credit card statement so here's what's gonna happen i'm gonna call penelope over i'm gonna leave her alone on the couch and you're gonna walk up to her and say hey i just bought you this hairy poop on necklace make out with me and see what she does okay all right Cody, Joseph, you hide behind the couch. <laughs> you know he's about you, to take the fattest L, bro. This. Oh, my God. Right, Penelope, just sit right there. Junior, what's going on? <coughs> I have to use the bathroom. My stomach hurts. Again? <laughs> hey. Hi. I got you this necklace from Harry Poupon. Oh, my God. Really? Yeah, it's all yours. Oh, my God. Thank you so much. It's so beautiful. Yeah, you want to make out? <laughs> no. You don't want to tie oh! my hairy mustache? Ew, <laughs> no. Go away. Oh, fine. Poor. Creep. <laughs> okay, Penelope, I'm back. Wait a minute, where'd you get that necklace from? Oh my God, Junior, this weird kid with a mustache gave me this Harry Poupon <laughs> necklace, and then he asked to make out with me, and I told him to leave. You accepted a necklace from another man? We're breaking up. No, Junior, <laughs> this is great, because now you don't have to give me this necklace anymore. Junior but, messed it all up. He could have probably got some crazy... Let me let me not go down that road, okay? Well, you did, Junior. That creepy kid did. No, My I boy Junior could have got Junior. some crazy yeah, top Penelope or some shit, you know what I mean? Just give it to her yourself. But he no, messed it all up, man. Well, tell her I got it for her. Yeah, Penelope, he bought you that necklace for the other kid to give you. This was just another test to see if you'd cheat. What? Well, I think you're going to cheat on me, so I hired two guys to see if you'd cheat on me, and you didn't. Well, I didn't, so now what? Well, now you have the Harry Poupon necklace. Oh, my God, really, Junior? So does that mean I own her now? <laughs> no, Junior. <laughs> oh man, oh, my dad's shit. Pissed. Uh, Santa Claus, all I want for Christmas is my dad not to beat my ass. <laughs> Junior, you ran the charges on my credit card. Oh, I'm gonna beat your ass. <laughs> no, someone save me. Oh, 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 oh. Santa Claus. I asked Santa Claus, the only thing I wanted for Christmas for you not to beat my ass. Oh man, I guess I can't do it now. But I can. $3,000 on a necklace. I'm going to beat your ass red like my rosy cheek. Oh! Junior! <laughs> Let's be honest, though, guys. Junior completely deserved it.